Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome. For you guys that are not new here, know that my background usually looks a little bit nicer than this. And yeah, my nano leaves broke the other day. So I tried my best to do a little bit of a ambiance light in the background until I can get my new ones. And that is going to take a while, unfortunately. Apart from that, guys, we're going to watch The Last of Us episode 4 today. And bam! Episode 3 is my favorite episode so far in this show. It was the story with Bill and Frank. That story was so beautiful, romantic, and it also gives you hope. You know, I, I believe in destiny, souls, mates, and I think that showed it. They really showed it that everything is possible. Everything is possible and what an ending to their story. So goddamn beautiful. I just saw that this episode is a little bit shorter than the other ones. This one is 45 minutes. So we will see. I think this episode is going to be a little bit more action. You know, they cannot go deep dive in emotions every episode of course they can but there is a lot of things that is gonna happen we know from the game so i think it will be a lot of action but who knows we i was in a big surprise when i watched episode three so i'm probably gonna be surprised for this episode also if you guys want to watch the full reaction head over to patreon and other than that guys i'm ready hope you guys are ready let's begin New, 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 new. hopefully we're gonna see a little bit more of the infected today because we haven't seen super much of the infected we only see the clickers once and you know then random infected here and there but you guys already know i'm looking forward to the bloaters more clickers more infected in general oh it's frank's gun it can be so good but also so bad at the same time Scared me. <laughs> we have to do this every hour? Gas yeah, breaks down over time. Nice. How does that work? It's a siphon. It's when liquid travels against gravity. You don't know. I know it works. <laughs> <laughs> he tried. He tried. Uh, we're gonna give him that. Okay. This is your fault then. <gasps> the it comic book! How much you push the envelope. It'll still be stationary. Finally! I've been waiting for the comic book. Because that is such a big, important thing in the game. She is waiting. Feel free to wait in the truck. I got something. Here. This is actually before my time. It's a winner, though. Got something else. Wait! I think they listened to this one, right? In the game. Right on the reading, but it has yes. some pictures. Those magazines. I don't even walk around with that thing. Yes, let's go. I want to see what all the fuss is about. No, this is exactly from the game. Stuff then she's going to throw it out of the window. I'm just with you. Let's go. Love it. It's this song, then. It must be. Oh, look. Oh my god, that's so cool. Oh, look at the train. It's so cool. I love to see the environment. All right, that's enough for today. Rest a little bit. Yeah. I would be afraid to go off road like that if the car gets stuck. Ravioli, is it? Hmm. What am I even eating? It's 20 year old Chef Boyardee ravioli. Yeah. How long are we staying out here? I figure I sleep tonight. Drive tomorrow all day, all night. So can mm. we start a fire? Now, why am I going to tell you no? Because infected will see the smoke. Fungus isn't that smart. It's too remote for infected anyway. Other people then. People? Yeah. Actually, it smells kind of good. Well, that would be Frank's then. Oh. Oh, I'm getting paranoid seeing this. Oh, I just feel it. Something's going to happen and I don't like it. Ask you a serious question. Yeah. Why did the scarecrow get an award? Because it was outstanding in this field. Oh! Did you read this? No. We go to sleep. I love it so much, guys. Let's go. And this is a part of building their relationship, in my opinion. This is a big part of it. That's why I've been looking forward to it. There's no way anyone knows we're here, right? 
No one's gonna find us. No one's gonna find us. That's kind of the similar question that Tess asked Ellie. If anyone is gonna come and look for her boyfriend, family, parents, you know. Oh, I don't know. Is it only me? I'm paranoid. Oh yeah, he's not sleeping. It's gonna be so tired though. Oh. What the fuck is that? You don't like coffee? <laughs> That's a lot of coffee. Damn. Well, he needed. He needed. Hasn't he? Hasn't been sleeping all night, and he was gonna drive now for the whole day and night. It smells like burnt shit. Well, I don't like coffee either, so <laughs> I'm with Ellie here. Where in Wyoming did you say your brother was? This contact came through a radio tower close to Cody. Cody? Ah, oh, man, that is deep up in there. And if he's not there? Probably close to another city out there. What's his name? Tommy. Tommy. Younger or older? Younger. Tommy's what we used to call a joiner. Dreams of becoming a hero. So he enlists in the army right out of high school. Being in the army, it didn't make him feel much like a hero. Convinces me to join a group making their way up to Boston. It's where we met Tess. And then Tommy meets Marlene. She talks him into joining the Fireflies. The same mistake he made when he was 18. He wants to save the world. Of course, last I heard, he quit the Fireflies too. So now he's on his own out there. And... If you don't think there's hope for the world, why bother going on? I mean, you gotta try, right? You haven't seen the world, so you don't know. You keep going for family. That's about it. I'm not family. No, you're cargo. But I made a promise to Tess, and she was like family. What if you don't find him? I will. You got it pretty early if you want to grab more sleep. I'm not even tired. <laughs> Knew it. Knew it. They're in the city. No, there's a high risk of other people on the countryside, but it's even higher in the city. Stay put. I don't trust. Why is it all cleared out on that side? And here it looks like chaos. What are you gonna do? What are you doing? We can jog right around this tunnel, take the next ramp, and we're back on the road minute tops. That's a human that's done that. That's Stop. not infected. Yep. She sees something. Is that the QZ? Hey! No. Uh -uh. No, that's not for real. That's not for help? real. No. no, no, you're not helping anyone. Yeah, wow. see. No, I hate this so much, guys. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, it's so similar to the game. You see that hole? You can squeeze through. Do it. When I say go, you crawl to that wall and you squeeze through and you don't come out until I say. And they're not gonna hit you. They're not gonna hit you. you stay down, you stay low, you stay quiet. Go! Ooh. Oh, he had his chance, yo, to take that dude out. That scared me, guys. But that was Yoel's gun. Take take their weapon. Take their weapon. Or ammo at least. No! <laughs> Ellie. Is she gonna bring out the gun? Oh, come on. Ellie, I think you need to do something. Mm. She saved him. Damn. No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna go home. My mom isn't far. If you can get me to her, we can be friends. I didn't know. I'm Brian. What's your name? You can have it. It's a good knife. Get back behind the wall. No, 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 no. Please, oh, no, no. this please, is rough. Please, please. Yeah, he didn't even waste a bullet. I'm okay. I uh, got some food in here still. So... Got your light, so. Stay close. The armored cars and trucks. Brian. Well, Brian, no more. We have lost people since that night. What else do you want me to say? Kathleen. The Berg Quests. Mark Anthony Halpin. Henry Burrell. You know where Henry is. I wonder if this is the cell where my brother was beaten to death. This has gone too far. 
Oh, it has to stop now, you mean? Now that you're in the cell. But before, people dying was okay. When you were safe and protected and ratting on your neighbors to Fedra. Kathleen, for God's sake, I delivered you. I held you in my hands. I never told them anything about your brother. But Henry did. And we know that he's still in the city. Where is he? I'm your doctor. You always need a doctor in your camp, I'm just saying. Yep. Who did this? We think it was outsiders. Could be mercs. Well, if Henry has a radio, maybe he called these guys in. Will he live? What if I had a doctor? There's no chance. Yeah. This is Henry's hey. work. And he won't stop until we stop him. Find every collaborator and kill them all. That's the truck, baby. They really going all in for this. Are we okay in here? Oh no. A little bit, maybe. There's a really tall building like four blocks away. As soon as we don't hear a truck, we move. Are you okay? I'm all right. Are you all right? Yeah. Thing is, if I didn't hear that guy coming, you shouldn't have had to have. Well, you're glad I did, right? You're just a kid. And you shouldn't know what it means to. It's not like you killed them. I know what it's like. First time that you hurt someone. I mean, it was my fault. You shouldn't have had to. And I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. It's rough. It wasn't my first time. Show me your grip. It's time. Finger off the trigger. Now, who taught you that? Fedra school. Figures. Left hand squeezes down on the right. There you go. Okay. Uh-uh. You put it in your pack, you shoot your damn ass off. <laughs> she never listens, huh? Never. Always doing it his or her own way. Always. Kathleen, huh? No sign of them. You? Yeah. What did they find? This is not Joel and Ellie. They found something else. Yeah, this is their apartment buildings they were mentioning. What's up there? Oh, there's someone that's been living up there. They're out of food. Henry won't let Sam starve. Double the guards around our provisions. What? What now? Something else you want to show her? Storage room? What? What is that? What? Fuck. Is that like the fungus or what do we tell the others? Not yet. Let's just handle what we have to handle. Seal off the building for now. That's something new for the show. I got you. Where'd you be without me, huh? By now, Wyoming. <laughs> yeah. Walked in and out. Yep, you did. I'll take a look at the city and find our way out. We're going up 42 flights. 45. <laughs> Fly five. Woo! Long way to go. Hey, you know the guy who said he was hurt? How did you know it was an ambush? Seen it before. I've been on both sides. Mm -hmm. Even done it before. A long time ago, we did what we needed to survive. You and Tess? And the people we were with. My brother, too. Did you kill innocent people? Does she want to know? Come on. I think that was enough answer, right? 33 floors. That's good. Come on. Give me a minute. Get up, you lazy ass. <laughs> 56 years old, you little shit. That's smart. Joe! What? What are you doing? I don't want someone sneaking up on us while we're sleeping. I get it. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Are you sure you're gonna hear it? Of course I'll hear it. That's the damn point. Well, good night. Yeah, good night. Hey. Yeah? When we were talking about hurting people, what did you mean it wasn't your first time? I don't want to talk about it. All right, I'm just saying, it isn't fair, your age, having to deal with all of this. So it gets easier when you get older? No, not really. The reason I asked whether you'd hear the glass or not, what if you don't hear too well from your right side? Is it because you were shot there? Probably more from shooting. Joel, do you know diarrhea is hereditary? What? Yeah, it runs in your genes. Oh, I love it! I love it. 
Jesus, indeed. That is so goddamn stupid. <laughs> you laugh. I didn't laugh. You're losing it big time. <laughs> This is what I said, their relationship is just growing and growing. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. I love that. She can hear Joel. something. <gasps> no, someone is even there. Yep. Ah, what an ending. What a cliffhanger. Damn. Oh, that episode was way too short. All right, guys, that was episode four. And God damn, what a cliffhanger. And this episode was too short, as I said, but it was very, very good. I think this episode really brought in all the similarities with the game. It was like, it was so much. The dialogue, the scenes, items, you know, with a gentleman magazine in the car, the music, the comic book. Finally, I'm so freaking happy that they finally brought in the comic book because as I said, that is a very, very important thing for me at least when i think about ellie in the last of us i think about this comic book and the jokes and as i said also numerous times how joel and ellie is getting closer to each other by doing these jokes and now we're also getting into the more city atmosphere or the more city environment compared to the nature the countryside that i said before and we're meeting people and people are freaking scary we haven't seen any infected that I was hoping for. I want to see a little bit more infected, but it is what it is. For you guys that don't want to hear about my thoughts about the last scene, it is spoilish if you guys haven't played the game. So please uh, skip this part if you don't want to hear my thoughts about the end. But for you guys that have played the game, you know that that is Henry and Sam that they met in the and we're gonna see how the show is gonna involve this relationship and this you know situation between joel and ellie and sam and henry because that is it's it's big things happening in the game when it comes to their story so i'm looking forward to see how they're gonna do this in the show so what was that in the basement what was that i I guess it has something to do with a fungus. The network is underground and it's gonna burst open and some or infected is gonna take over the place. I don't really know. Or is it a bloater living under there? Yes, I hope so. <laughs> I think this episode was a lot about Ellie and Joel coming closer to each other. You know, their relationship is getting stronger and stronger. They're getting to know each other more and more. And to see also that Joel is caring about Ellie a lot, you know, with the, you know, he's getting a little bit uh, paranoid and protective and he's thinking about Ellie's best. You know, if he didn't care, he wouldn't care about, you know, telling Ellie to go behind, go behind the wall. And uh, yeah, we also got to see Ellie uh, getting a little bit savage there and she saved Joel's life. That's just how it is, guys. Um, yep. With Frank's gun. Frank. Bill. There's, they're still going in this story, you know? But yeah, guys. I think this episode was really, really good. What do you guys think? Uh, please let me know in the comment section down below about your opinions. And if you know what that... Or if you have any clues what that thing is in the basement. In the storage room. Please let me know. And yeah, don't forget to like the video, comment, and if you want to see my full reaction, head over to Patreon. If you didn't know, I also stream over at Twitch, so you can come by there and say hello. That would be awesome. Other than that, guys, thank you so much for watching until the end, and I will see you in the next episode.